in this video you will see how to send mail merge with cc bcc and attachment i already have a video on how to send mail merge and another video on how to send mail merge with attachments this video is going to be a little advanced because with this tutorial you can achieve all your mail merge needs we will use an add-on for Microsoft Word which will let us send mail merge emails with CC, BCC and attachments. You already know that the default mail merge option we see on Microsoft Word doesn't have the additional option we are going to cover in this video. Let's download the add-on from this website. You will find the link to the add-on in the video description. This add-on provides 30 day of free trial uses after which you need to purchase a premium plan if you want to continue. After downloading the file, unzip it and install the application. If you have any open Microsoft document like Microsoft Word or something, you need to close it down because it is going to be installed with the Microsoft Word on the computer. Now click on finish. I already have my mail contacts saved to an excel file. I have created two columns for cc and bcc emails. And I have my mail merge email template ready on this word document. Here I will connect my contacts first. The process is same as you do on a normal mail merge setup. Click on select recipients, use an existing list and I will select the contacts file I have. Now I will insert the merge field. I will need to add the name here. Insert merge field name. I will need to add the name here because this is a basic email template I have created just to show you the CC and the BCC option. Now let's preview the results. Now I need to select the merge and send options here. This option is coming from the add-on we installed. Here we need to select the two field where you want to send the email. I will select the email column here. For the CC, I will select the CC column. I have on my contacts Excel document. And for the BCC, I will select the BCC column. If you do not have a BCC column, you can leave it blank. For the subject, I can select a column if I have a custom subject line for the different receivers. But I want to use a static subject for everyone. So I will type my subject here. Now for the attachment section you can add custom attachments for everyone. For that you need to create a column on the excel file you have. And on the column you should put the file paths for the different receivers here. For this tutorial. I will use one attachment for all the receivers. So I will select the insert file and I will add my file here. Now we are ready with our mail merge setup. You see the send five messages button here. It shows five messages because I have five rows of contacts. Before clicking on this button, I will change another option under the sending settings. Under the delivery option, you will see the sending starts is set to 3 minutes. I have it 0 because I have tested it before so I set it 0. But for your case, you will see it 3 minutes. So make sure you are setting it to 0 if you don't want to wait to send the mail merge emails. Let's send the email. When you click on this button, you will see a confirmation pop up if you want to send the emails. Click on the yes button to proceed. Now it will open Outlook on your computer. Select the sending email account. This is important if you have multiple email accounts added. I have only one email so I will select it. You see the stats here, how many emails it is going to send. Now open your Outlook application to see the emails. Select the Outbox folder. You will see the email merge emails are being sent. And some of the emails are already here. These will be sent in a few moments. You can see the status here. When the sending is done, you can check the sent items and check the individual emails and see if it has been sent with the CC, BCC and the attachment we have provided. Everything looks good here. 
If you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. If you have any question, you can ask in the comment section. Thank you for watching.